This is Kevin Coughlin of the Star Ledger. With me at Rutgers today is Jim Logan, a medical doctor for NASA. Uh, Jim, would life on the moon be bad for your health? It could be, uh, depending on the hazards that we find. There are a number of hazards, uh, lunar dust, microgravity, radiation, and even some of the synergistic effects that can happen as a, as a combination of those three. And how about psychologically? Well, psychologically, I don't think sortie missions on the moon will be all that difficult. Uh, the Russians have done missions over a year in space. Uh, we've done missions of six months. Uh, the current sortie mission uh, scenario involves uh, starting off at basically a two-week mission duration and eventually evolving to six months. So initially, I don't think that'll be a problem. Eventually, we might see some problems, but I don't think it'll be a big one. What's the greatest danger that an astronaut would face on the moon? I think the greatest danger would be to be in the wrong place at the wrong time, exposed to the wrong thing. As you know, there are solar storms, uh, so we're going to have to have very accurate space weather, so the crews will know when there's a solar flare uh, uh, on the uh, way. Uh, the habitat will probably have to be shielded. Uh, if they're out doing EVA, they're going to have to get a warning, and they're going to have to be able to get back into a shielded hab uh, in time.